guys welcome back to my youtube channel i hope you're doing well and i hope you can hear me i'm in the airport and it's like nearly 3 a.m and for the first time i'm the first in the queue to basically uh, check in my luggage i have like a luggage to check in and then the other one is for the cabin i'm excited and like yeah just looking forward to traveling I love taking early flights because uh, I'd rather just wake up early and just, you know, sleep in the plane and then enjoy my day when I arrive. So I haven't told you yet where I'm going, but you will see. And yeah, so I hope you enjoy the vlog and I'll catch you up later. airport and I'm just waiting for my next flight so I did Dublin Paris in economy and I'm actually glad because for the first time ever I'm in Paris and I don't need to go home I'm actually going to somewhere nice and I don't know why I get keep the destination because it's actually in the title I guess so I'm going to Dubai it's gonna be the first time for me I just was looking for a very sunny place that I know is not gonna rain although they had experience in food the past two weeks but I think it's gonna be a nice holidays it's only I'm only going for four days but still like I just need the sun and that's why I selected Dubai and fun fact well I don't know if it's fun but for me it is I actually did not pay anything apart from my upgrade for the flight to Paris to Dubai which is in premium economy so initially my whole flight the two flights that I booked are economy and I did not pay a dime because I had points from my work because I work very hard I had points for my work and basically my flight and my hotel were paid through my reward scheme in work and I wanted to have a nice leg room for the 7 hour flight or 6 hour flight so then I decided to uh, just upgrade on the check-in so that's what I did I upgraded for the check-in and now my flight from Paris to Dubai is premium economy so I'm just gonna tell you how it is I've never been in premium economy before I just wanted to try it and see if it's actually good and to be honest with you like six to seven hours in economy I know I've done that when I was 16. I've never tried premium economy before and I'm looking forward to trying it. It's meant to give you more leg rooms and just yeah more space. So you basically like it's not business, it's not economy but it's just a little bit premium. So I'm gonna tell you because I've never done that before um, and actually this is only my second international flight. When I say international it's more like outside of Europe because usually I do travel within Europe quite a lot for weekends but apart from when I was 16 and I went to Canada this is going to be my first time leaving the Europe region. So yeah, so I'm just excited and to be honest with you I was so busy during my week that I did not plan anything. I'm just gonna go there and explore. I just know a few things that I need to see to buy but I haven't really booked or planned anything. There is a bird in the airport. 
is a world in the airport, but anyway, so I'm looking forward to having a nice hot weather. So my luggage are here. I also have like a suitcase that I checked in uh, in Dublin, so it's gonna follow me in Dubai. And yeah, that's pretty much it right now. I'm having my little breakfast. Yes, yeah, so I'm just gonna drink my hot chocolate, which is actually very, very hot. And I also have croissant and I have pain chocolat. I don't know why I say croissant in the English um, accent but you get me and yeah so very excited and it's also a solo trip because I just want to take time for myself and to relax and hopefully um, if you want to go to Dubai yourself by yourself as a girl uh, in a solo trip or maybe you're a guy and watching this video I'm more than happy to show you my hotel what I'm going to do so you can also be inspired or else just know what to avoid I hope I really hope the hotel is nice it's a five-star hotel so it should be nice and in terms of activities I literally just planned what I'm gonna do this morning when I was waiting for my flight in the Dublin airport so that's it really guys and I'll catch you up later as usual So here is how premium economy looks like with Air France. So this is my section and I was just looking for my seat. Very happy and pleased with this. Um, so as you can see there, much more comfortable than classic economy. You have a pillow, you have a free headset. They give you some stuff as well. And on this side, you can see there is a footrest. Um, there's much more space for my legs. I have a wider screen and I took a window seat. They also gave us some toiletries, uh, like a toothbrush, a toothpaste, a sleep mask, so that was really cool. The menu for lunch was excellent and it was created by a Michelin star and I really loved it. So yeah, I ate very well. Well, 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 the contrast between the lunch and this is just very big, but anyways, we are landing and they just gave us like a mini sandwich because we did not have time to have a proper dinner. And yeah, I guess this is what you get in Premier Economy. It's not all luxury, but it was actually nice. So I made it, I am in Dubai airport and I'm just going to security so I can just go to my hotel. The airport is very big and it was quite late. I think it's around half 10 at that time when I'm filming or maybe a bit later. But anyways, it's just me walking through the airport. So as soon as I arrived, I had my chauffeur book. This is just the handler and he was like asking me for a tip. But anyways, here I am in the car and I think I'm going to stop my vlog here. So I'm going towards my hotel. I need to stop the vlog here because otherwise you won't come back if I show you everything. So next time you will see my hotel and it will be the proper vlog. But I hope you enjoyed and thanks very much for watching. As usual, stay blessed and see you later. Bye bye.